Hi guys, it's Jen here. Today I'm going to show you how to make slow cooker pepper steak. This is really good. The beef gets so tender and you really only need a few ingredients. So I have my slow cooker sprayed with olive oil spray and then you're going to use a round steak that is about one and a half to two pounds and you're going to cut it in thin strips about this size. And you're going to add that to your slow cooker Okay, you don't want your beef too thin um, because it will cook down in there. So um, I usually cut them about three inches long and about a half an inch to an inch um, thick. And then you're going to need a quarter of a cup of soy sauce. Just pour that right over top. You'll also need half of an onion chopped and two cloves of minced garlic and you can just add that. Then you're going to need a teaspoon of sugar, about a teaspoon of salt, and about a half teaspoon of pepper, and you're just going to sprinkle that over top. You'll just mix that together, and you'll cook this on low for five to six hours, and then you'll need to cook your peppers and tomatoes um, in there for another hour. So I have two green peppers that I cut into strips and a can of diced tomatoes, a 14 and a, half, and a half ounce can. So you'll let this cook on low for five to six hours and then you will add those. Okay, my beef has cooked for five hours on low, and then I'm going to add my two green peppers that I sliced. I'm also going to add a 14 and a half ounce can of diced tomatoes, and I'm just going to stir that in and uh, cover it and cook it on low for another hour. Okay, once your peppers and tomatoes have cooked on low for an hour, you're going to make a mixture of one quarter cup of cold water and one tablespoon of cornstarch. And then you're just going to mix that in and turn your slow cooker to high. And you'll just wanna cook that on high until the sauce thickens up. And this would be a great time to cook your egg noodles. We like to serve our pepper steak over egg noodles. And um, if you're going to have a salad or whatever, you can make that while your sauce thickens up. Okay, my uh, sauce has thickened up some and I like to serve my pepper steak over egg noodles. So this is what it looks like when we serve it. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. If you have any questions, feel free to comment below. And if you enjoyed this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching.